Alright guys, so new morning, it is Monday morning, and um, I had some editing issues here, so I probably won't be uploading all these videos until I get back. Wi-Fi is really crappy here for laptops, at least the phone's not too bad, but um, the editing software is having a little malfunctions, so hopefully when I get back home, I'll be able to do it on my PC. Aside from that guys, it is Clark and Company, I'm excited to bring you this uh, Pokemon Go slash vlog video today, because you guys saw Dollywood, Dolly World, I forget what it is. Load it with Poke Stops. There's a Poke Gym there too, which we will be taking and adding a Pokemon into. But I just want to say, quick starter pack, Tropical Fruit Nut Trail Mix, by far a great starter pack. We got a few Pop Tarts that we're going to enjoy later tonight as well. But I'll check back in with you guys when we get to that uh, Poke Lore phenomenon. All right, guys. So we made it to Dollywood, and you see what I'm seeing right now. Look at all these Poke Stops, and there's one, two, three gyms. I think they're all mystic right now. Let's see, one, yeah, it's two, so right. they're all mystic. So hopefully I can train them and pit a Pokemon of mine in there and get those coins and Stardust, because I don't know if you guys saw, but I've been saving up a lot of Stardust. I think I have like 50,000 almost. So many Pokestops too. I've been hitting them all. I've been going all around. I have an incense going right now as well. I might put a few lures down on some of the stops as well, so that might help. The rest of my family is on a water ride right now, but I don't feel like getting wet, not today. I'm doing white water rafting tomorrow, but look what just came up. A Kingler. 14 King. What a horrible throw. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Of course. Oh my good. Easier, I think. It, again, it popped out. Are you kidding me? It's a three. I'm not using a great ball on a Krabby. Or on a Kingler or Krabby, whatever it is. I'm not using the Great Ball. Or an, oh my god, it's a Krabby. So, oh my god, not even two? I'm gonna use a Raspberry. And if it doesn't get in, if it doesn't stay in this time, I'm just gonna, I'm not even gonna bother. I don't like wasting these Pokeballs. Come on, come on. One? Oh my god. No, no way. Hold on. I thought I said I was gonna run, but no way. That's it. I'm out. I'm out. Got this Poke Stop right here. Let's see. Too far away. What? What? I will walk to that. Alright, so this ride is almost done, so I'm gonna gather up with the rest of the family and then I'll check back in in a few minutes. If anything special pops up, I'll be sure to get that on camera, hopefully. And uh, yeah, so uh, I'll catch you guys in a few minutes. Alright, after going on a few rides with all my family and everything, we come across this eagle here, and that's obviously not a wild eagle, it's in a cage, but look at this. Eagles are just such a nice, majestic creature. Doesn't seem too happy to be in there, but still a beautiful creature. But uh, yeah, we're still walking around, and uh, Pokestop's doing great. Every Pokestop, you already know I'm hitting up. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a few. You already know, in Tennessee, we're gonna find all types of food. But this hot, fresh cinnamon bread baked daily, come on now, come on, look at this. Oh my goodness. So much sugar in it, I don't even care. I'm just gonna feast in. And hopefully it tastes amazing, I already know it is. And also, real quick, I don't have a recording on my phone, real quick, but this gym is being held down. I have a Pidgeot in there, you can see. That's my username. Like but look, there's a Venusaur in there. That's the first Venusaur I've ever seen on this game. That's actually insane. I've never seen the Venusaur. And uh, 1242 Venus store, that's actually pretty crazy, but uh, I'm gonna feast on this bread, so yeah. We got my highest wild capture ever, hopefully capture. It's a gold bat, I'm not recording right now, let's see, it's a 1104 gold bat. That is absolutely insane, so I'm gonna use a raspberry real quick. All right, should I look at the phone, raspberry. I'm actually gonna use an ultra ball for this. Get a little spin on there, maybe. Oh my god, horrible, I hate flying Pokemon. Get that great throw, great throw. Come on, one roll, two. I uh, didn't even get the two. All right, excellent throw. Okay, come on, come on. One, two. No way. No, I think the game froze. No, no. Oh no, it just popped out. Oh my god. Said nice throw. That's how you know I'm getting it this time. Come on, one, two. Three, let's go. Let's go. Look at this, guys. I don't know if I can see that. But 1104 gold bat, and it's almost maxed all the way out. Let's look at the moves. It's got a wing attack, 
and I'm just waiting about to walk into something. But great capture, guys. I am sweating so much from that. That was actually stressful. I'm not recording my screen. But oh, look, look, hold on. You see it? A 1260 pincer. This will be my first pincer. I got it. I got it. It broke out. Oh my god. It ran away. No way. No way. It ran away. Oh my god. Oh my way. Something else came up. Oh, it's a cool fairy. Alright. Alright, that's it. I'm done. Alright guys, we just got back from Dollywood and I must say the first day was actually very, very amazing. I had loads of fun, great family time, there was a lot of stuff to do, plus you already know we've been hitting all these Poke Stops and Poke Gyms. And uh, I just want to recap on Pokemon real quick. I did catch a Cubone off camera, I didn't pull out the camera in time, I wasn't even thinking, I just threw the ball, caught it and it, it happened. But uh, you guys saw that pincer showed up a 12.06 or 12.60, I think, and it ran away. Oh my, I'm so butthurt about that. That would have been my highest one. We would have beat my record today. I caught that gold bat today, and that pincer would have beat that gold bat. That would have been insane. But uh, I think today, to end off this video real quick, I think I'm going to do an evolution, and it's going to be this uh, Ekans, 502 Ekans, to get that um, Ak... Akbar? I, I don't know. It, it's Cobra spelled backwards. I don't know how to say it. But uh, let's go ahead and evolve this. Alright. Oh, that looks insane. Man, that thing looks so mean. Dang, you hear that thing? Oh, my phone's on 6%. New register to the Pokedex. Alright. Oh, I got that whole page complete. Alright, let's go. 1088. Alright, that's a great evolution. Oh, it's almost, it's almost done. Alright. It may be a little more on the power bar, but that's alright. Arbok, that's alright. Um, great evolution. That thing actually looks insane. Alright, real quick, one last evolution. Today, I saw a Butterfree, and it ran away from me. I was very disappointed from that. So, I have a Metapod here that I'm going to evolve and get that Butterfree. I actually don't have one. That's why I was disappointed that it ran away. So, let's evolve this Metapod. Get that Butterfree. I, I'm not, I don't even know what CP this Metapod was, or I don't even know what to expect. I just want that new Pokemon to the Pokédex. Here we go. Butterfree, what's the CP at? Like 700 maybe? I'm thinking 700. This Met Metapod wasn't that good. 530, okay. It was a really crappy Metapod. So I'm going to end it off there, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please drop a like if you enjoyed. And just a quick reminder, this is probably going to go up a few days late because there's some editing issues here and the Wi-Fi is very poor. So, uh, yeah, so keep that in mind. Yeah. Uh, all that fun shit. Yeah.